In today's video, we're going to learn how to use the Adobe's new Firefly tool, which is in the beta phase right now, to create stunning images and add any detail that you like using artificial intelligence. Just give it prompts and it does the job for you. On the left side, you see these original images and on the right side, you would see the images that I created using this tool. And trust me, it takes only a few seconds. If you wanna learn how to do that, stay till the end of this video. So first of all, open up the link here. It's firefly.adobe.com. Open this link up and you would see this screen. It will ask you to log in. So if you're not logged in already, do log in and then scroll down and we have multiple options available. Text to image, generative fill, text effects, generative recolor. In this particular video, we're going to see what the generative fill option does for you. So we'll click generate. I can upload my images or I can pick a sample image from these images that I have here. I'm going to pick this image where this lady is standing and I'm going to tap try. Now, this is the main interface. You would see these brushes here. So you can add, subtract selection. You can change brush settings. You can change the background. So we'll go to do those options later in this video. But first I'm going to make my selection. So I'll, I want to change the clothes. Now you see this lady is currently wearing a jacket and a t-shirt. I want this to change and I want her to wear a suit. And in order for that, I'm going to first of all, start making my selection by just tapping on the screen and I'll select the areas. It doesn't have to be a hundred percent accurate and perfect and precise because the details that you miss, AI is going to autofill those details for you. And AI has a lot of power as we all know by now. So I'm going to quickly make my selection. Try selecting as much area as possible. And in order to make the brush smaller, you can either change it in the brush settings or you can zoom in and it'll make the brush smaller. Now you guys can see I've made the rough selection. I'm going to just fix the corners slightly. And there you go. If I zoom it out, you guys can see that the selection looks good now. And now, where it says describe the image you want to create here i'm going to type in the instruction so i want this lady to wear a suit so i'm going to just type suit and tap generate let's see what it does for you and it's only going to take a few seconds currently it's doing its magic in the background it is currently working let's, let's just wait for it for a few seconds and see what it has done so you guys can see magically this lady is now wearing a suit so she was wearing a t-shirt and a jacket, but now she's wearing a suit. So I have four different options available. I can pick from one of these options if I'm happy and satisfied. If I'm not, I can also tap more and it's going to create more images for me. I think I'm happy with this one, the suit that she's wearing here. If I'm happy with this one, I'll just tap keep. And now I want to change the background. So I would tap background and what it'll do is it'll select the background and remove the background from this image. And then it'll ask me, what do I want to see in the background? And in this particular case, I'm going to give it an instruction and I'll ask it to make this lady stand in London in the streets. So I'm gonna just type standing in London streets. And then I'll tap generate and let's see what it does. So give it a few seconds while it is working and only within a few seconds, you'll see it's magic that it does for you. So now you guys can see that in the background, we see the streets of London. So I'll go ahead and see which option do I like the best. I personally like this one. I think this is looking more professional. And you guys can see I changed her clothes. I changed the background. And if I zoom it in, you would see these minor details that's the beauty of artificial intelligence because it does the job for you in a way that it looks extremely realistic so i can go ahead and keep this selection so this is the image that ai has just created for me she's wearing different clothes now she's standing somewhere completely different and it looks completely realistic now once i'm done i want to save this image download this image in order to do that top right corner you would see these three dots tap there and tap download it'll start 
downloading after you tap continue it'll start downloading the image for you in your gallery and we'll look at the finalized image and it's giving me the option to download i'll tap download and it has already started downloading the image has been downloaded it is in my gallery you would see this logo in the bottom left corner here so image not for commercial use it says but we've created this image just now and you guys can see this is the image that we have just created i'll just go ahead and download this save this in the gallery it is already saved in my gallery so that's how you create stunning images you can change your clothes in your images you can change the background using artificial intelligence if you like this tool, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you are new here. And if you haven't subscribed already, I'll catch you in the next video. Thank you. Bye bye.